Putin is a head of state. Do you think that uh, a head of state can just be arrested anywhere? How many crimes have your country committed in Iraq? How many crimes have everyone else who's so vocal today committed in Iraq and Afghanistan? Have you arrested them? <laughs> Africa is on strike. Investors now are very negatively disposed to this country. They've lost faith and they've lost trust. For outside investors, they look at the foreign policy, diplomatic orientation of South Africa. They see that right now you are locked in a tense dispute with the United States because the US sees you as deeply sympathetic to Vladimir Putin's Russia, despite the Russian all-out invasion of Ukraine. We have explained those issues. Our government is dealing with those matters with the United States of America. We are not locked in any dispute of any form. And uh, we are none aligned when it comes to the conflict in Russia. And uh, that is the line we're pursuing. Well, the U we, for, for a start, we, the U.S. We, ambassador here in South Africa said that he had evidence that weapons had been loaded met, onto I a met, Russian... I met, I met with him yesterday. He apologized for being overzealous and uh, saying things that he shouldn't have said. Yeah, you, you say and he's he, apologized. We have not heard him himself issue an apology. Well, I am saying to you, he have apologized. I met him right here in the Revolutionary House yesterday. Your government has, has launched an investigation about that alleged correct. weapons it shipment. Is, is Can you categorically guarantee to me here and now, as the head of the ANC, that no weapons were put on board that vessel? Our government has reassured the ANC that it, there is nothing to the, to the truth about weapons uh, being exchanged between our countries. I, I phrased my question carefully. Can you now categorically say no weapons? Am... Isn't she amazing? <laughs> Oof. But Put on board I, that I, Russian I, ship. I, I've explained uh, to you that uh, there is a, a, a action that has been taken by our government in terms of investigating. South Africa is a, a treaty member of the International Criminal Court. If Putin comes here in August as planned, your government will be obliged to arrest him. As head of the ANC, do you believe your government should and indeed will arrest if Vladimir Putin? If it was Putin? according to the ANC, we will want President Putin to be here even tomorrow. You would? To come to, come, to, come to our country. But you... <laughs> we welcome Vladimir Putin here of right now. We will a man who is being investigated for war crimes by the we International We will welcome Court. him to come here as part and parcel of BRICS, but we know that we are constrained by the ICC in terms of doing that. Putin is a head of state. Do you think that uh, a head of state can just be arrested anywhere? How many crimes have your country committed in Iraq? How many crimes have everyone else who's so vocal today committed in Iraq and Afghanistan? Have you arrested them? You, you, know, you know the impact that You're this You're making a lot of noise about putting in state of working for peace between Ukraine and Russia, and you failed to resolve the war. Where are the weapons of mass destruction? Tony Blair went to Iraq and claimed that there are weapons of mass destruction. Do you see anybody standing against that in the United Kingdom and Britain? More than uh, millions of people have died in Iraq and yeah. Afghanistan, and there are no weapons of mass destruction. We know... Uh, yeah, Korea. Рост производства – это результат увеличения. Какая разница? Oh, what the war is about between Russia and Ukraine. We want peace. That's what is important, so that world can thrive. And organs and institutions of the world that institute world peace must not be conspicuous by their silence in deciding right. decisively. We, we, we don't have much time left. I, just want, I want to bring it back to uh, domestic South African politics before we end. <laughs>